Hey ladies, so welcome back. So today we're going to be doing another crochet install. Sansbeauty.com reached, reached out to me and they sent me this hair. Okay, this is the Netty Goddess Deep Wave Dreadlock Crochet Hair. Okay, and they sent me eight packs. They sent me a number one, which is black. And I thought that this would be a cute hairstyle because I have installed... The full dreadlocks, but never in a deep wave. And I thought that this would be really, really cute to rock as a protective style, especially with the spring weather here. It's raining a lot in my city, so this would be a perfect hairstyle for me to rock. Okay, so like I said, they sent me eight packs, and this is the Goddess Dreadlock Deep Wavy Hair. Okay, on in each pack of hair it's about 24 strands it says it on the back and the hair is about 16 inches so let's get ready to install i am going to untie this hair and we'll be installing it okay so i am back and i have one of the strands in my head i mean in my hand not in my head so as you all can see i have french braid in my hair straight to the back you guys basically know um, my braid pattern is very simple. I have eight braids, and like I said, it's going straight to the back. I gather my tails, and then I sew them down, okay? So with the hair, I want to point out that the hair is pre-looped. That's the little loop right here. So like I said, it is pre-looped. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start installing on this braid right here. So I'm going to take my crochet hook, and I'm just going to slide it under my hair. Just like this. And then I'm going to take the hair, hook it on there, close the latch, slide it through. And I'm going to slide the hair down onto the hook. And then I'm going to take the end of the hair. Just like this, close the hook. Pull it through. Take it out of the hook. And just pull it straight up okay so let's do it again we're going to take another piece so i'm going to slide the hook under my braid latch the hair onto the hook close it pull the hair through and then i'm going to let that hair release down onto the latch take the latch take the end of the hair hook it on close it and we're going to pull it through and I'm doing it this way because I don't want to disturb the wave pattern of the dread so I'm just doing it this way okay and then I'm just going to repeat this all over my head so I'm just going to continue latching the hair I am back and as you all can see I have been installing off camera and this is how the hair is looking this is very very pretty the hair is lightweight I know sometimes when we're installing the hair I know I get messages from ladies saying that their crochets are heavy but this is not the case this hair is very lightweight okay so I am just going to Finish up installing my faux dreads. And this style actually reminds me of the first time, it was about, I'd say about seven years ago, when I was at work, I had saw a customer. She came in and she actually had her dreads wavy like this. And I, I was so intrigued by her, her dreads. And I asked her, how did she achieve the look? And she told me that her hairstylist had used pipe cleaners on her hair and it gave her that wavy look. So this is exactly what it reminds me of. Okay. So like I said, I'm going to finish installing and I'll be back. So ladies, I am done installing the hair. And right now I am just laying my edges down because you know you got to get those edges on fleek. So yes. So ladies, definitely check out sansbeauty.com. I am loving my wavy dress. This is so, so pretty. This will be one of the styles that I plan on revisiting because I like how the hair looks. 
and I like how it feels. So like I said, check out sansbeauty.com. If you're not on their e emailing list, definitely get on their emailing list because they always have great deals and discounts like I always tell you ladies. So I hope you all like this video. I want to thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.